Hello, welcome to another video by Zaytech. In this video, I'm gonna talk about how to close your online orders from your laptop or from the Clover dashboard. Previously, I mentioned how to close the online orders from the Clover device, but let's suppose you're not at the Clover device. You're at home, you're at your office, you're on vacation, you're somewhere else, and the next day you have to, you have to close, and, but then you don't have access to the Clover. So the way to do it is you log into your Clover dashboard, remember from a laptop, from a computer, you may get away with it from doing it from your iPhone or Android device or tablet or iPad, but I recommend using your laptop, it's just easier um, because it's just a wider screen. Unless you have a big phone, you may be able to do it from there too, but try it, it may work. All you do is you go to clover.com, log in, choose the right location. That's the most important part is choosing the right location. Most merchants, they may have three, four, five, ten 10 locations and they usually close the wrong location or they only close one location. Um, so you wanna make sure if you're closed for holidays for all locations that you close all of them, okay? If it's just two locations, just close two of them. So once you find out which locations are gonna be closed, you choose that from the drop down. Again, it's at the top left uh, where, you, where it shows your business name. And then from there, you're gonna to go to account and setup, which is at the bottom left. So keep in mind that Clover can change where this buttons appear. So if you're watching this video in the future or some other time, it may be somewhere else, but at the time of this recording, it's at the bottom left. Click on it and then you'll see something called um, settings or has lots of information here as you can see. Click on business information and from here scroll down until you see the hours. Try not to mess with anything else in case you um, you know, try to upload different business logo and you can't save it. For now, just change your hours and then after you change your hours, you can go back and make other changes. So scroll to the bottom, choose which day you wanna close and then put closed. If you're gonna close for two hours, just change the hours and press save. Um, keep in mind that if you do close for a Tuesday or a Wednesday or a Thursday, that you're gonna have to come back here the next day and unpause it or unclose it or open it again because if you put close for a Tuesday, that means you're closed for every Tuesday because the way Clover's business information works, it's by the week, not by the month or not by, not by calendar. So it's week after week after week. So let's suppose today is Thursday, you're closing, and then um, you come back Friday, you know, as long as you do before next Thursday, you wanna open Thursday back up again. Uh, once you do, you'll be open again next Thursday. And that's how you do it. If you have questions, uh, reach out to us or watch our other videos um, or watch the other video on how to do it from your Clover device if needed. Thank you so much. Have a great day.